हेलो स्टूडेंट सब्जेक्ट बायोलॉजी पार्ट सेकंड यूनिट नेम स्टडी ऑफ एनिमल टाइप कॉकरोच टुडेज वी आर स्टडी डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम ऑफ कॉकरोच डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम ऑफ कॉकरोच कंसिस्ट ऑफ माउथ पार्ट्स एलिमेंट्री कैनल एंड सलेवरी ग्लैंड एलिमेंट्री कैनल इज अ ट्यूब विच आर डिवाइडेड इंटू थ्री मेजर पार्ट्स फोर गट मिड गट एंड हैंड गट फोर गट इज कॉल्ड एज स्टोमोडियम मिड गट इज कॉल्ड एज मेसेंटेरॉन एंड हैंड गट इज कॉल्ड एज अ प्रोक्टोडियम एलिमेंट्री कैनल इज अ लॉन्ग ट्यूब अप टू सिक्स टू सेवन सेंटीमीटर into different diameter and two openings of elementary canal it is divisible into foregut midgut and hindgut the first part of elementary canal is mouth mouth is free oral chamber is narrow space bounded by mouth parts hypopharynx is present at the center of mouth salivary ducts open at the base of hypopharynx hypopharynx is a teeth of cockroach uh, tongue of cockroach mouth opens into foregut foregut consists of pharynx esophagus crop gizzard pharynx is a first part of digestive system of cockroach after mouth pharynx is very short narrow muscular tube it contains taste sessile it leads to esophagus 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 is a slightly long tube it opens into crop crop is larger pear shaped sac like organ it is temporarily stores the food and then sends it to gizzard gizzard also called as proventriculus gizzard is a small spherical organ it is provided with a circlet of six chitinous teeth and backwardly directed bristles teeth are responsible for crushing food bristle helps in filtering the food foregut ends with gizzard this is gizzard sixth teeth are present the crushing and grinding of food part in the gizzard bristle helps in filtering the foregut ends with gizzard after the gizzard the ending of gizzard opens in stomach the second part of digestive system is called as a midgut or also called mesenteron the midgut consists of stomach and hepatic cecum the stomach of cockroach is a straight short and narrow it is lined by a glandular epithelium which secrete digestive enzyme hence stomach is mainly responsible for digestion and absorption hepatic cecum thin transparent short and narrow lined by glandular epithelium hepatic cecum secrete digestive enzyme and thus help in digestion of food after the completed midgut the second and last part of hepatic cecum opens in hindgut the 
hindgut consists of ilium colon and rectum this part is called as also proctodium ilium ilium is a short and narrow part of hindgut malpighian tubules open in the anterior lumen of ilium near the junction of midgut with hindgut posterior region of ilium consists of sphincter ilium sends nitrogenate nitrogenous waste and undigested food towards colon after the ilium the colon colon is a longer and wider part of hindgut it sends the waste material towards rectum colon reabsorb water from waste as per need the third and last part of hindgut is rectum rectum is a oval or spindle shaped terminal part of hindgut it consists of sick rectal pad along internal surface of absorption water rectum opens outside by anus anus is present on ventral side of 10 number segment anus is last posterior opening of digestive system it gives out undigested food from outside the body three parts of digestive system foregut midgut and hindgut foreguts and their part esophagus gizzard the part of midgut is stomach and hepatic cecum the third part of digestive system is hindgut it is divided into ilium column and rectum in the digestive system first part an important part is salivary gland cockroach has a pair of salivary gland which secretes saliva each gland consists of two glandular lobes and one receptacle or reservoir concentrate to figure after the pharynx right and left side salivary glands are present glandular lobes consist of many irregular shape and white lobules these lobules secrete saliva each gland has saliva duct both duct unite together to form a common salivary duct receptacles of each glands is thin walled elongated sac like structure each receptacle has a duct this duct unite to form common reservoir duct both common duct common salivary duct and common reservoir duct unite together to form common efferent salivary duct Efferent salivary ducts open at the base of tongue or hypopharynx. Concentrated structure the upper part of salivary gland is hypopharynx. Then common efferent salivary canal. Then common reservoir, common salivary duct, reservoir duct, salivary duct, and last is a lobular salivary duct. which store the saliva for the secretion of saliva the glandular part is present the function of salivary gland is secretes saliva 
फूड एंड डाइजेशन कॉकरोच इज ओमनिवरस इट फीड्स अपॉन प्लांट एंड एनिमल मटेरियल इट हैज चिविंग एंड बाइटिंग टाइप ऑफ माउथ पार्ट्स दैट चिव द फूड एंड पुश इन टू एलिमेंट्री कैनल एज फूड पासिस थ्रू एलिमेंट्री कैनल इट इज डाइजेस्टेड एंड फाइनली अनडाइजेस्टेड फूड इज इलिमिनेटेड थ्रू एन एस next topic is circulatory system of cockroach or also called as a blood vascular system cockroach has open type of circulatory system that consist of colorless blood called hemolymph a dorsal blood vessels and hemocell the circulatory system circulates the colorless blood called hemolymph the cavity inside which is hemolymph is fast is called as a hemocell then sinuses dorsal blood vessels and blood circulation in cockroach is a topic of circulatory system we are study one by one hemolymph hemolymph of cockroach is without any pigment hence it is colorless it consists of plasma and seven types of blood cells also called hemocytes plasma consists of water with some dissolve inorganic and organic solutes it is rich in nutrients and nitrogenous waste like uric acid hemocell body cavity also called as a coelom body cavity divided into three sinuses due to two diaphragm dorsal and ventral diaphragm dorsal and ventral diaphragm are thin fibromuscular septa attached terga dorsal diaphragm has 12 pair two thoracic and 10 abdominal of fan like triangular alary muscles alary muscles have pointed end attached to terga at lateral side and broad end lies between heart and dorsal diaphragm ventral diaphragm is flat above the ventral nerve cord attached laterally to sterna at intermittent point sinuses coelom of cockroach is gets divided into three sinuses first sinuses is a pericardial sinus perivisceral sinus and perineural sinus pericardial sinus is dorsally very small and contains dorsal vessels perivisceral sinus middle largest contain of fat body it has almost all major visceral organ and reproductive organ jointed by perivisceral sinus perineural sinus ventrally side present small in size contains ventral nerve cord and continues in into towards leg circulatory system of blood or also called as a blood vascular system of cockroach is a dorsal blood vessels and their details the dorsal blood vessel is present in pericardial sinus below the tergum it is divisible into posterior heart and anterior aorta heart is about 2.5 cm long narrow muscular tube that opens anteriorly and closes posteriorly it start 
from ninth abdominal segment and extend anteriorly up to first thoracic segment. Thirteen chamber of heart, ten in abdominal region and three are thoracic region. The heart of cockroach is thirteen chamber. Next, blood circulation in cockroach. How to blood circulate in a cockroach body? Blood circulates alternate contraction systole and relaxation diastole of heart. Movement of alary muscle circulates the blood between sinuses. Diastasis is the third phase after diastole in the heart cycle. During this phase, heart remains expanded state. During diastole, alary muscle contract making dorsal diaphragm flat. Due to this blood passes from perivisceral to pericardial sinuses through fenestry and finally to the heart through ostia. During systole, contractions start at posterior end and wave of contraction passes anteriorly. Blood is then pushed toward cephalic vessels and dorsal aorta. During systole, ostia remain closed with the help of valves. Systole push blood to head region and then perivisceral and perineural sinus. Relaxation of alary muscles during systole causes dorsal diaphragm to become convex. Reducing the volume of pericardial sinuses. This makes the blood to move from pericardial sinus to perivisceral sinus and towards fenestry. In this wave, the circulation of cockroach take place. Thank you.